So today we're going to continue on our custom card review streak, even though it broke the other day. I'm sorry, guys. Uh, but hey, we're doing a double upload, so I got to make up for it because this is going to be the video that makes up for me missing yesterday's video. So let's just pretend like I didn't break the streak. Now, anyways, uh, it's going to be like a what if future Gohan unit. And it's coming from Zam. So before I go ahead and read Zam's card, send me custom cards over to bhdevcustomcards.gmail.com so I can review a custom card in the near future. Um, one thing I do got to say is make sure you guys can like uh, send like the documents in like an accessible way. Because I've tried to open up a couple of documents from you guys. And there was actually one person in particular. I'm not going to say their name, obviously. One person in particular sent me a bunch of like documents like a bunch of like pictures and stuff and it, it kind of got messed up on my end and like it got a little bit corrupted for me so i tried to open up the document and it just didn't open up at all so try to like you know send it to me like in an accessible way like a for example this microsoft word document like i'm just gonna pull up a uh, zam's thing so like for example uh, well this isn't microsoft word this is google docs but hey like in like a google doc or i don't know you can do google slides uh, you could do Microsoft Word too. Um, you could do it like a PDF. PDFs work also. I've done custom card videos on PDFs. Look at that defensive stat, by the way. Golly, Zam, you are a defensive guy. I, <laughs> I could tell. So, um, with that being said, let's jump straight into it. So, an alternate reality Super AGL, Super Saiyan Gohan Future, and Android 16. Definitely a what if unit for sure. All right. So their leader skill is connected hope, three key, and two hundred percent across the board so they are a carnival lr their stats are pretty crazy i'm not gonna lie well the attack is low but that defense that defense is wow i mean damn near 18k all right so their super attack for the 12 key sudden rush so they get 50 percent attack and defense one turn while doing colossal damage with a 50 percent chance to seal seal chance you you don't really see that on many custom units and their 18 key health lash combination 50% attack and defense for three turns. Good, of course, while doing med colossal damage to enemy and greatly lowering attack. All right, so their super attack effects are looking good. 50% chance to seal is definitely pretty interesting. All right, so their passive looks good on that screen. All right, beautiful. So the passive, kind-hearted warriors fighting for the future. Activist interest animation once only when there is another connected hope ally on the team and guards for the first five turns from appearance. From first appearance, of course. So they get guard for the first five turns, provided you have a connected hope category ally on the team, which you're, of course, going to be running that if you're running them as a leader, right? I'm going to assume this card is strong. I mean, custom cards are typically strong, right? <laughs> five key and 160% attack and defense at the start of the turn, and they also get an additional 40% attack and defense per existing enemy up to 80%. So if you are fighting two enemies, you get just a free... 80% attack and defense. Okay. And if you're fighting just one enemy, it's just 40% attack and defense. And they also get 58% attack and defense when performing a super attack. And they also get 70% attack and defense as well as 30% damage reduction when collecting key spheres as the second attack in the turn. And they also get key per keys are obtained. Of course, that being one. So one key per keys are obtained. And they perform a guaranteed super attack. When doing a 18 key super attack, that is nice. That rewards them for getting their 18 key super, which is obviously good. And they also perform an additional attack that has a 50% chance to come a super attack. When facing it, wait, 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 wait. Performs an additional attack that has a high chance to be a super when facing a realm of gods category. Okay, I found that a little weird to read off the off the tongue. So yeah, they get an additional super attack chance when you're facing a realm of gods category enemy. Realm of gods. Huh. What is this? Dragon Ball Heroes? Okay, so they get it. What it's it's future gone in Android 16. What they have a Roma Gods restriction for their super attack. Uh uh their super attack chance? That's interesting. I mean, I do like what they're doing in their base form. Um, I do like they're getting they're getting 30% damage reduction with guard, of course. Uh they are they do have keeper keys are obtained, which definitely helps them get their guaranteed super when you do an 18 key super. So and that's about it. There's nothing too much to this card. They also have the additional super attack chance of facing a Roma Gods category. I mean, certainly interesting. Certainly interesting. Okay. Their acting skill. Let your anger flow free. Transforms into Super Saiyan to go on future. The uh, acting skill conditions can be activated when HP is 60% or less, starting from the fifth turn from the start of battle. 
or when it says fifth turn from battle start, but it's pretty much just swapped around. Or when facing a Roma God's category enemy, started from the fourth turn from the start of battle. So it just says battle start, but it's just swapped around. <laughs> Roma God's category enemy. Am I missing something? I, I, I gotta be missing something. Huh. Okay. Um, so their links are Tough as Nails, Solid Support, Soul versus Soul. Man, I haven't seen that link in a while. The Innocence, Dismal Future, Fierce Battle, Legendary Power. So, Super Saiyan 2, Gohan, Future. New Super Attack Effects as well as a new passive. So, uh, the new passive, well, new Super Attack Effects. So, the 12 key, that being Sudden Rage, 50% attack and defense for 3 turns while doing Colossal Damage. Okay. And their 18 key... Uh, that being Gohan's Anger, 100% attack and defense for 3 turns while doing Mega Colossal Damage and still greatly lowering attack. That is strong. Yeah, that is strong for sure. Alright, so uh, his passive, a warrior at full power, 8 key and 160% attack and defense just at the start of the turn. And you also get an additional 158% attack and defense when facing only one enemy. Nice. And 58% attack and defense when performing a super attack. Nice. Uh, and 70% uh, attack and defense, as well as 30% damage reduction when collecting key spheres, so easy. And uh, keeper keys are obtained, nice, 158% attack and defense while performing a guaranteed super when the key is 24, so pretty much he gets buffs and a guaranteed super when he's at 24, nice. Performs a guaranteed super, and as well as a guaranteed crit facing a Roma God's category enemy. And categories are as shown, and he also has a couple links that do change. He gets some of these, these, uh, links that would be something that would look like it would be on a super saiyan 2 go I, I couldn't find the words for it like super saiyan uh saiyan warrior race golden warrior um a couple things who is future gohan and android 16 fighting that's a realm of god's character i i gotta be missing something because it's like a xenoverse because it says it's a what if card i mean i i get it obviously it's a what if but who would who would 16 and future gohan be fighting I that's that's the real question. Beerus? No. Champa? Let me stop. Let me stop. So uh eight key, 160% attack and defense start turn. Nice. 158% attack and defense when facing only one enemy. Nice, which is pretty much 95% of the game. The small five percentage is like battle road. Uh battle road. Uh and one more, hold on. Battle road. Let me stop. <laughs> 30% damage reduction. He does lose his guard. Of course, he's, he only has that for the first five turns. Um, So his only real defensive ability is that 30% damage reduction. This guy's not sitting in slot one. Absolutely not. He is your cornerstone slot two or maybe three unit. Yeah. I mean, I like that he's getting keeper keys for obtain. I like that he has a 30% damage reduction. I do like that he's getting a bunch of attack and defense inside of his kit. Uh, 160% attack and defense right over here. 158% attack and defense performing super attack right over here. 58% attack and defense right over here. Well, no, this 158% attack and defense of facing one enemy, but it, the 58% attack and defense is when he's performing a super attack right over here. 70% attack and defense right over here. 158% attack and defense right over here for just getting his key, which is obviously nice. Um, The question is, is he going to touch 24 key? Probably not. Probably not. I don't think this guy's easily getting a 24. Is he? You can certainly. Hmm. Orb changers on connected hope. Okay, we're not even gonna think about that. Uh, Zam W card. Interesting. Um, the realm of gods thing is definitely who would, who in the hell is future Gohan and Andrew 16 gonna be fighting? That's a realm of gods character. I gotta be missing something. I I'm definitely missing something. But yeah, I think that's about it. Uh. Go ahead and send me custom cards to bhdevcustomcards at gmail.com so I can review your custom card in the future while I'm getting all these older custom cards out of the way. Um, yeah, W card. I mean, interesting. Interesting. Definitely like a cornerstone slot two, slot three unit for sure. I don't think you're putting this unit in slot one. Although, Future Gohan has some strong super attack effects. 50% attack and defense and 100% attack and defense multiple turns from both his 12 and 18 key super attack effects. While getting an attack defensive buff from his passive to a super attack effect with damage reduction, keeper keys are obtained, um, guaranteed crits, guaranteed supers built into him. He has all this nice stuff. Um, but yeah, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> he has all this stuff built into him. I don't know if he's going to be able to easily get 24 key. Who was a rainbow orb changer 
or an orb changer in general that would help this guy get to that key. Okay, whatever. For connected hope, of course. But yeah, that's it. I appreciate you guys watching. You guys are the best. I'll catch you guys next time. I absolutely love you all. You guys are the greatest. Peace.